morning, guys, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I want to introduce my group. We are group number one. We are the students of business administration, which we are studying in this third year. Our group consists of four members. First, it's me, Novus Gadizade, Ünal Ramazanov, uh, Yusuf Bey Seferli, and Elbi Kerimli. Uh, we just finished our business plan, uh, which is uh, dealing with online shopping. Uh, we call our business uh, uh, name is idlemarket.az.az. It means that you can do your shopping via online. But why do we choose this market? Because currently in the Baku, nobody uh, offers you any service by delivering your product. And uh, with using our system, you can uh, benefit with uh, delivering your products to your uh, door. But is there a question in Azerbaijan generally? Internet is not widely accepted, and we uh, solve this problem as a, we, uh, we are just uh, setting a call center and giving you our customers user ID, and that's all. They just call and uh, tell their product, and that's all. They will benefit from our company, and uh, with this uh, idea, we are focusing on first customer satisfaction. What's customer satisfaction for us? Customer will satisfy like uh, this customer will save his time, uh, his money, and uh, his health will save it by uh, with our delivery system. With getting this customer satisfaction, we divided uh, our uh, idea into four main parts. First one is marketing, then operations management, uh, and accounting and finance, and uh, supply chain management. And we want to add uh, that these are four fields, are they are same, and uh, all of the focus should be customer satisfaction. Okay, no, please. Uh, they target the families with children, and uh, we are considering uh, that parents uh, are working, and uh, most of them want, doesn't want to send their children uh, for shopping, and then uh, after a uh, birthday day, after a working day, uh, shopping in the food market uh, and, and carrying products uh, to the home is also for difficult, um, difficult for them. And then uh, we are also we can also uh, serve uh, in the um, small and uh, small and uh, mid-sized restaurant in the back row. And these groups, uh, this target group are also um, pro uh, seems profitable for us uh, as we considering uh, that every cafe. Um, every cafe uh, need uh, to do um, fresh grocery in, uh, every day, and uh, so uh, that's why owners need to hire somebody for the jobs, and for sure it costs uh, them more money. And uh, using uh, our online in shopping itself, uh, they can uh, be efficient and uh, be efficient and. Uh, and uh, reduce the cost. Mm -hmm. um, uh, these days, uh, these days uh, having a website uh, is like having a business card, uh, uh, even a uh, simple uh, uh, website feed. Acts as a virtual store storefront uh, to sell our products or sales, uh, make our company um, uh, more visible to uh, more visible to uh, um, Baku audience, receiving orders and um, payments, complement our other market uh, marketing and uh, uh, efforts. Uh, this is an example of our uh, website. Computer. Uh, we are two main computers in the market right now, uh, but none of them, but none of them uh, save all my grocery right now. Uh, this is very, uh, mm, this is very positive advance for us and for our business. Now we talk about our fork analyzed. Uh, first of uh, first product. Uh, we choose our, our main product is service. We serve uh, with, uh, on the right time with the right amount uh, to, uh, to solve the customer, customer uh, solution. And price, second price, our product, uh, our product will be uh, low cost because we don't have uh, uh, we, we don't have a uh, renting house uh, which is which uh, needs uh, high cost and that's why our pr product is uh, at the low cost and. 
uh, then uh, we, need, we solve this, uh, this problem, uh, this uh, customer cost, then uh, place our main uh, location will be as a uh, subway station uh, near there, uh, because uh, being there uh, gives us a chance uh, to deliver our product without delaying and uh, without uh, struggling the traffic jams. Then uh, promotion we will get our customers with uh, uh, giving advertisement at, in the internet, uh, journals and uh, newspapers, uh, good things. Then operation management, we divide our operation management part into three sections, product operation, policy concern, and on-time delivery. First, product operations, uh, choosing, uh, we, uh, we, uh, ch choosing what to sell, how to sell, from where we will buy these products, uh, is our product operation part. Second, quality control. We will examine our, uh, our product before buying it from somewhere and before selling, selling it to someone. And uh, we will uh, provide high quality products. Then on time delivery, we, we will provide on time catering service, on time delivery service, and it's door, door to door, door service. And with this, uh, we need uh, full efficient cars and experienced drivers, experienced drivers. Then, uh, we will, uh, then we will uh, give uh, our workers uh, once a week uh, uh, education part and in this part our workers will gain habits such as uh, how to treat, how to act with uh, customers ethically, ethically and, uh, how to oper and, and how to be operative in working hours. It's our operation management part. Thank you. Okay, uh, now let's move on to the tandem and finance part. Uh, first of all, um, let me begin with that. We did a pretty close uh, review, I mean, uh, focus on market and uh, we researched and the data we gained is um, very helped us to gain very precise um, estimate numbers uh, but still um, we ask that real markets and we gain this information so our initial investment is 60,000 and, and this is for us uh, paying from our own uh, savings at uh, 15,000 each and so first of all our cost um, initial investment um, First of all, we're gonna rent a warehouse. We're gonna pay three thousand um, each month for a warehouse, and then um, shelves, refrigerators, computers, and furniture. It's our equipment, and um, we have a certain amount for this too. And if a website will cost us five hundred um, as original manas, and this also includes a licensing from Rabatana Zubey, Minister of Communication. Then um, we're gonna need a car for deliveries. We will need. Four cars, small cars, and big uh, cars to buy a wholesaler and bring it to our warehouse. In total, it will be 36,000. So, um, yes, and our monthly expenses, um, we have an inventory cost uh, to replenish our inventory. Um, first of all, we're going to buy from a wholesaler, or we're also going to buy from the supplier companies who will bring it to ourselves. And um, we will spend uh, two. 2,500 uh, uh, in from the wholesaler and uh, about 3,000 from the uh, supplier companies. So in overall, we'll total in five um, 55. And um, we're gonna pay electricity. We calculated that uh, for winter months, we're gonna pay uh, pay 300 uh, as average months. And for the three summer um, months, it's gonna uh, amount in 500 because we will use extra air conditioning and stuff. And um, rent per month is again 3,000. So in total, it's going to be 1,350. And um, also, it's a wage that we're going to pay to our um, employees. Next slide, please. Yes, and rent per month. Yeah. OK, and this is our revenue earned for three months. We decided to make it for the three months because according to Azerbaijan law, uh, taxation, uh, they check in every three months, so our period is going to be three months. And um, our revenues will be um, 30,000. Uh, let me first say where we're going to get the money. Of course, markets, we're going to get the money from selling uh, the products, but also we will have some extra um, money, cash flows, and it's advertisement that we're going to post on our websites. and. Um, um, the, we're going to give membership to our clients and from that money. And expenses, there's inventory costs calculated for three months. It will amount in 16500 And so it's pretty much just month expenses added three. And uh, then 
what we do, just simple math, we subtract this amount, and we find that in first month, in first quarter, we're gonna start with a loss with being 10,650, 650 manats. But um, furthermore, we will increase our uh, share. <coughs> In the first quarter, we had uh, only 150 buyers, which paid 10,000. Now, um, in the second quarter, we will have a double um, market share. So, um, initially, it will lead us to uh, more profitability, and we will finally gain a profit of 4,650. And uh, this is um, this is uh, our market share, and this is how we plan to increase it. We're gonna. <coughs> You see, first month we start almost nothing. We have no buyers. Then uh, we increase. We have uh, 150 buyers, then 300. So our goal for a month at least get about 600, 700 buyers. And with this, we will initially increase our profitability. Uh, yes, as my mate said, that it means that as much as we have more customer, as much as revenue we have. But in this kind of business, we also need supply chain management. Why do we need it? First of all, we are, our company will spend 85 or more than 85% of its revenue to buying off inventories and materials. It means that if you buy less uh, or cheaper inventory, you are going to make a profit. And in the second, uh, our customers will daily meet uh, their uh, needs and will daily inform us, but we have to be ready uh, for uh, serving them, and that's why we have to manage our supplies because of the uh, flow of inventories and uh, materials and at the last part today uh, supply market condition as Azerbaijan uh, for example not very uh, uh, well organized first of all there are too many suppliers and you have to make a decision and this decision uh, for example for fresh food you have to every day go to the some wholesalers and uh, for other uh, uh, foods you have to uh, have a contract with them uh, and that's all uh, for today this is a company this working as with systems, this, uh, this uh, research, and this is that's all for today. Thanks for your attention, guys. Thank you very much. Okay. Any questions? Uh, I think we want to speed up because we have some teams. Very good presentation. Thank you. Thank you.